hello everybody welcome back so we are going to continue playing with Clifford you can see I made some money with all that stuff that I sold in the previous episode so what we're going to do now is we're going to go back to the hub and we're going to go and talk to our ninja friends that's over there you can see I'm very over encumbered 85% so I'm going to sneak and walk Hopefully that will train my strength a lot. You can see my strength is 24 currently. The other stuff is still very poor. My stealth is picking up slowly. Yeah, I'll show you my wares. So I still have a lot to do. My athletics is slowly picking up as well. So let's hopefully we make it safe to, to the hub. To go and talk to our ninja friends over there. We must be very, very careful. Could be under attack very quickly. But we made some good money. Let's see if our strength actually goes up. You can see the strength is going up very, very rapidly. Because I'm carrying people and what I did as well is I mined some iron, which is very heavy to help with the strength training. As you can see, it's helping a lot. So I'm pushing very hard on my strength. Can you hear the flies of this body I've been carrying for so long? Let's just wait, wait. There's some people over there who are they? Holy Nation Outlaws. They shouldn't attack me, but you never know. There they go. Okay, you guys fight whoever that is. Enjoy yourselves. I'm just passing by. You didn't see me. I'm gonna run around like this for a while because like I mentioned I want to get my strength up as much as possible hopefully to 80 or something so I do believe if I remember correctly the the heaviest weapon in the game is about 80 kilograms or something like that so if I want to swing that weapon, I must be as strong as possible. So I'm going to go and talk to our ninja buddies up here. Maybe join them. And then we'll see from there. Bob is very very quiet. Do I still have food left? Not a lot, but yes I do. So in the hub, if you want to talk to your ninja friends, they are way at the back. They have a small tower. There you go, that tower over there. Take sneak off. Let's talk to this guy. The Shinobi Peeves. So you want in on the Shinobi, eh? The guards try to lay the crack down, but they ain't fooling nobody. They're nothing. Nothing a few cats can handle. I want to join. You can join for a fee. 
That's it. I don't have to complete tests or prove myself. Do I look like I've got time for handing out busy work? No, this is a business we're running, not a social club. Just one time membership of 10,000 cats. Okay, so let's give it to them. So now we're part of the Shinobi. We should see it. Where is it again? Oh, here you go. Factions. You can see Shinobi thieves. We are now 100% with them. I don't think you can buy from him. Let's go and see if he can, can find his friends. There's a few things I would love to buy. It's that guy up there maybe. Maybe this one. No. Let's go up there. Somebody. And we can do some training over here. Which we're definitely going to do. Just looking for that person where you can actually buy stuff from. What do you buy? Illegal goods. It's not this person I'm looking for. Maybe it's still little bit up don't see anybody really I don't know if it's because of mods or stuff I don't have a lot of mods on this playthrough you have something to trade oh there you go okay so let's see I definitely want one of these backpacks it's 2000 that's excellent so what I really would want to do and I would like one of these swords as well what's the price it's a little bit steep but what I am going to do is I'm going to put down I'm going to talk to this person again where is it see that person yes so I'm going to throw down all this stuff in this backpack. Almost there. go so let's talk to this person again I'm gonna sell that backpack I'm gonna buy this one I'm gonna I'm gonna sell these weapons I'm gonna buy what's the price I'm gonna buy that one I'm just gonna take the one weapon Let's see stealth. I really want to go into stealth. That one doesn't have a lot of stealth. This one has a lot of stealth. So let's sell that. We buy that one. Shoes. The shoes is not very stealthy. The one that I have is also not very stealthy. I don't have a shirt. Hmm. Much money do I have left? Let's buy the bottom one. Spend a lot of my money now, but it is for a good cause. I'm gonna sell the shoes as well. That's one of these. Do they give some stealth or not? That one does. So let's sell that helmet. Let's <laughs> buy that one. I believe that should be it for now. I'm going to pick up all my stuff that I left. 
Come on, pick it up. Why can't I pick it up? So much more space, why doesn't he want to pick it up? Oh, because this is not stacking this time. Okay, so just at least that iron that didn't. Okay, which is still fine. It's not gonna bother me that much. How much is left? Two iron. So let's see, is there somebody we can sell these to? Well, let's go and do some training. I think it's time to do some training. <laughs> we are looking very funny. Okay, let's do some training. Let's see how over encumbered we now are. Still 78%. So we're training a little bit of melee now. In the beginning of the game you must do as much training as possible. Because uh, later on when you really start to play. You you want at least your one of your characters to be strong while the other ones do their training and stuff like that. We did spend a lot of money, but it is worth it. You can see here this uh, backpack that we got. It's very, very good for us. With athletics, combat, stealth, dodge, and so forth. It's still doing okay, so we'll still continue. on we'll do we'll finish this one and we'll move on to the next let's do a little bit of training on all this stuff okay so he doesn't want to do any training on the sword which is fine Let's do some lock picking training. That might come in handy a lot. Let's go. Can see lock picking picking up a lot. Assassination is at 10, that's good. But we are going to have to practice that a lot. At least we're part of a small faction at this stage. They will help us when we get attacked and stuff like that, so that's good for us. I am thinking of as the as we progress with this to slowly add a few mods that makes the game better. Kenshi has a lot of mods, amazing mods. So I am gonna slowly start adding a few. Let's 
still picking up. Do we still have food left? Oh, I will have to go and buy some food first. Okay, let's quickly see if this trading is going to make a difference. Not really. Oh, hunger is still fine, but I am going to buy food now. You have a few things that's not good for stealth and athletics. But overall we're not doing too bad. We must just remember when we go to the Holy Nation we should sell this. If they find this on us we're gonna be in big trouble. Because the Holy Nation is very against tech stuff. We'll finish this one, then we go and buy some food. Okay, I think we should go and buy some food now. Let's see where the bar is. It's down here somewhere. Start running. Here it is. Let's go and buy some food. Where's our man? It's the longest way. Slow it down. Let's talk to our buddy over here. Show me what you got. Would like to buy all that meat of yours. Anything else we want? Not really at this stage. Okay, so we're going to continue our strength training. Go into sneak mode. Let's walk all the way back. Strength is already at 29. Still picking up very nicely but we should be very very awake while we are doing what we are currently doing Because we are extremely over encumbered. We will not be able to run away. We can only run 5 miles per hour. Everything can catch us at this stage. Just want to see something for interest sake. I don't think stealth, stealth is slowly picking up. It's already on 43. Okay, so we will continue doing the stealthy process while we are walking. It might take longer. You can see we have picked up here at 9 stealth. But we can be way higher than that. Our athletics is very low, so it's 22%, but that is because we are carrying so much stuff. Your athletics you usually picks up when you're light and you can run everywhere. 
but we are currently pushing hard to get our um, strength up first. But uh, we will have a strong character soon and then we'll start to get some friends and we can slowly build up to buy ourselves a little house somewhere. I am thinking maybe Holy Nation. A lot of people don't like the Holy Nation but they do, they are very very strong. So we might just for protection say go and get a house there and work from there but in saying that then we cannot recruit um, skeletons or robots or any other of the alien factions because they don't like anything so I am still deciding on what to do or where we should go and settle we are way too weak to do our own base at this stage so we must buy a house somewhere Show them my gear. So what we can do now, it's night here. And I usually do it is I run around these guys to get my stealth even higher while it's night. That's usually because the stealth picks up when people can technically see you trying to be stealthy. So usually at night I like to walk around. as long as they don't threaten you it's nice to walk around there goes some kind of caravan get your stealth and stuff up but there's poor people crawling out do it up until 5 or 6 o'clock then we will continue our journey back to the hub let's just check our food is taking shots you can see because we are so heavy one of the reasons why we are picking up our strength is if you want to capture somebody like let's say you want to capture the phoenix or the stone golem or anybody you want to be fast while you are strong so you can knock them out grab them and run away from their guards so that's what we are going to try to do gonna see if we can topple a few of the big nations and see what happens to the world of kenji but that is still a very far away clifford still have a lot of training to do before that time Okay, let's quickly go to this bar take sneaking off because they might give us some trouble just to buy some food again hello mr barman show me what you have give me a few of this meat by four of them okay now we can go back to the hub you can run around towns to get it up as well but I find that a little bit boring so I usually run from one town to another after we're out of this town we can sneak in see how our let's see our stealth is doing exceptionally well our strength is on 35, still far from where we want it to be. Now we are doing well, we are doing very very, athletics is slowly picking up very slowly but as long as it's picking up we are good assassination we will and fevery we, we will still have to do a lot of going forward and we are gonna get beat up a lot we're gonna get jailed 
all that stuff is going to happen while we do our training. Maybe we should be brave. Let's let's run up to the holy nation here at the top and see what happens. We still have that book, so we must be very, very careful with this. Maybe sell it here at the hub first. Let's go to the hub and sell it. Don't want to get arrested now while we're still training. Or even killed. Because our toughness are very, very poor currently. One good hit from a strong person and we will be royally screwed. So a little bit of uh, toughness training will not be that bad. But we might have to do it maybe at one of the holy nation cities. Or even go back to squint there at the bottom and see if we can fight some bandits a nice place that I usually like to train as well but it is very risky is at the cannibal plains I might load that map so we can see the maps better I think I should do that add that mod let's go to the bar and quickly just sell that book off no, 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 don't do that. Talk to the guy. Almost made a mistake there. Sell that book. We will later buy new ones. Okay. Let's continue our journey up. Let's go here somewhere. Okay, start sneaking. Somebody was over there. You can see that arrows will usually point to where there's some enemies. So let's do some exploring while we are training. Our strength just went to 38. There's a bar over here as well. Let's hope we don't run into trouble. Now still we will not run away from anybody if we're in trouble. There's some people up there. Let's hope they... what are they? Did I stop? Discovered stack. Wait, who's this? Hungry bandit. Okay, come back. Let him go. Okay, we should be good. Let's continue our journey. food so why is my okay it's not my hunger starting to become night again down over there stack encumbers have gone down a lot almost what eight percent so slowly but surely our strength are going up 
39% already. Some more people over there. People over there at the top. Okay, who are these people? Escape servant, holy nation. They should not attack us, but you never know. Okay, let's avoid. Oh, oh, oh bone dog, bone dog, even worse. Let's give them a chance to get away from us. Bone dog, leave us alone. Yeah, go away. Look at how nice space looks. Look at the planets over there. Looks very, very nice. Oh no, please, it's this holy nation. Yeah. They should not attack me. This is holy nation troops. Just, uh, Excuse me, I'm not bothering you guys. I can see how nice and green it is here. It's all Audi Nation territory. I'm really excited about Kenshi 2, we're just not sure when it will release, but that should also be a very very nice game, if it's close to Kenshi 1. So only farm in front of us. See how our stuff are stacking up. Stealth is doing exceptionally well. This other stuff will pick up. Athletics will pick up as soon as we are happy with our strength. Oh no, I'm under attack by somebody. Who are you guys? Hungry bandits, so what we should do is put down and maybe throw down our backpack. So we're going to go down. See if we can run away. No, they hurt our leg. Let's try to fight back. Okay, we're down. We are playing dead. We're gonna take our food. Please, dog, don't eat me. But this is good for us as well. Because it should have made our toughness a little bit better. The bone dog's gonna eat the body that... We had with us, let's medic up. Going to sneak, medic. Then did I take my, oh, my medic pack is in my. Okay, so medic up. I'm not gonna pick up that body again because I might be in trouble. 
of that dogs if I do. So I'm going to go to this farm and see if there's a bo Okay, this let's go back here. It's, I don't have space, damn it. But there's no meat in any case. I wanted to see if I could find some meat. wonder if they will let me lie down here. To recover. Let's quickly see if there's some meat on these animals. No meat, but let's pick up one of them. Pick up. Let's go and sleep again. Okay, I didn't want to put you there. But okay, you lie there. I just want to heal quickly. We'll pick one of them up and continue our journey. I wonder if this is that farm. So they won't have food, so I will have to get to a town quickly and buy some food again. What's my toughness now? Where is toughness? Toughness is at a 9. Unfortunately, they hit my leg and I couldn't run away. But luckily, they didn't kill me. As soon as my leg is okay, I'm gonna start moving. Cause it's gonna take a while for a stomach to get there. Well, maybe not. It is picking up. Let's continue our journey. Pick up one of these. Let's continue our journey. But well, that could have ended very badly. Oh, something is wrong here. Oh, it's still loading in, that's why. Okay. Where are you going? Go there. And it looks very nice, there's greeneries over there at the river can see over there. Kenshi has a massive, massive map. String 43, still picking up. Stealth. Blister Hill. I believe that's where we want to go. So we're just gonna walk there, not really do anything, and then walk back to the hub. 
So it's just to discover a few things while we are still training. But Blister Heal is where the Holy Nation's big boss is, the Phoenix. And they might, might if me up if I don't have that book of theirs. That's why I'm not going to go into the city. Just close to it and then leave immediately. That's close enough. Let's go all the way back. To continue our training. You can see our encumbrance has dropped more than 10% now. So we are getting stronger and stronger. But the big thing will be stealth and speed at the end of the day. That's most likely bandits again. Let's push it all the way to Squin. Our stuff, if we put everything down that we have, let's see, carrying something in encumbrance is two big things that's taking away from our stuff. If we take that away, we're going to be f very, very stealthy. Our speed is because we're in stealth mode and because we're encumbered massively. Somebody's fighting over there. We're not going to intervene. Oh, I really need to get food as soon as possible. Almost forgot about that. So, it takes a lot of time to get your training and most of your stuff that you want done, but in the end of it, it's going to definitely be worth it. So, we have to push a little bit in the beginning and grind a little bit but it will definitely be worth it definitely you know what go to the hub first so we can we'll go to stack let's go and buy food at stack Somebody is close by again. Just that form. There's a nest or something over here as well. Our encumbrance is falling. You can see we are getting stronger. And this has fallen from 50% to 45. Our KO point has went thanks to that knockout that we got from 11 to 17. Our speed has gone up one mile. And our hunger rate is incredible, but you can see it here. But we'll buy food now as soon as we get to stack. But yeah, if we do this by the end of the day, we can have a decent character that can actually survive a lot better in Kenshi. Which is definitely what we want. Because Kenshi, if this character now dies, I have nobody else. Which soon we will get more people. But if he dies now, the game is over. Oh, 
almost at stack and we can buy some food. So my hunger is dropping rapidly. Currently I have no problem. We're soon gonna have have a little bit of a problem. Some traders, I think, or just some animals over here. They should not attack me. They're stuck over there. Let's take sneak off. So they don't think that I'm a troublemaker. Let's just make the speed a little bit slower. I don't have anything illegal on me. So guards, please don't kill me. Blessings, brothers. Just don't check me for that book. Else I'm going to also be in trouble. Should be a bar over here. Still extremely slow of carrying all this stuff. I don't have a holy flame. He's also not selling it if I'm looking at it. Like to buy your meat over here, my friend. And then I'll be on my way. See, I have nothing illegal. He left me alone. At least he didn't check my... If I have that book or not. The Holy Flame. Let's continue our journey. See our training going stealth 61, string 47. We're getting there, we're definitely getting there. We are going through a little bit of dangerous territory or very close to. There might be big things there and then we're dead. village we can buy some stuff over there if we wanted to it's a rebel base over here our guy are taking the law of the scenic route
We're gonna have a nice view from up here. The tower there. Nice vibrant night. The up over there. Don't see any cams. So hopefully we will be good. So our stream still going up. Wait a minute. Did they see me? Or they were talking to someone else at least. And they're killing the poor people. Or being killed. our food looking we already ate up everything okay let's take sneaking off let's see our guys actually slowly but surely let's see no still slow Hello guys, nice to see you again. Yes, check my gear. Let's go and buy some food. Straight. Give me some food. Let's buy a lot. And now back all the way to bless the real. I said in the beginning the game could, like I said, be a little bit grinding, but in the end it's definitely worth it. It will make us stronger, make us able to actually survive. But one of the important things which is you, you should actually do first is your athletics. Because the running away is usually the thing that saves your life. But I've decided to go for strength and style first. But usually you need speed. Strength was at 50, that's very, very good. The other stuff we will get as we go. Zoom out that flies are getting irritating badly. Ate some of the meat again. It's very, very hungry. Let's see something quickly. Um, dexterity. Attacking with light weapons. So the sword we have should be. The ninja blade should be good.
Not very good against robots. Very good against humans. Mm, no issues. Passing, what's this the hub? Is that right? Is that another base or camp over there? It's another piece of meat we are... No, I ate just one, okay. It looked like he ate something. We are getting low on uh, cats over here, so soon we will maybe get our stealth, use our stealth a little bit to go and do some... Wait, who's this? Slave mongers, okay, let's uh, try to avoid these guys. We do not want to be captured currently. Okay. We continue on. What I will do is after this episode, I will get my strength and stuff up. Maybe um, as soon as my strength are where I want it to be. Then we'll continue training the other stuff. There's some people over there as well. I hope that's Holy Nation. We are very close to their territory. Here we go. Holy Nation. But we were attacked by that bandits in Holy Nation territory. We're not doing a good job, people. Staying for still picking up nicely. My max carry weight is 67. It's going to take us a while, but we must push this through. What nation do you guys think we should collapse? All three of them, which is the Shea Kingdom, the Holy Nation and the Empire? Or what do you guys think? See, I don't think I have all of them. That one. See, Holy Nation, Sheikh. I don't have the United Cities yet. I'm talking about the United Cities when I say Empire. Do you think I should try to collapse all three or only one or two of the...
the block. Okay, we're definitely not going to block at this stage. Holy Nation Patrol, luckily for me. I could work on my situational awareness a little bit more. What is my strength currently? I want to pick that max carry weight up as much as possible. Hey guys, so I think I'm gonna. <laughs> I cannot just man. I'm gonna end the video over here. So what I will do um, is I'll get my strength and stealth up to where I want it to be, and in the next video we will most likely then get our athletics up, and after that the real adventure will begin. Thank you guys for watching. If you like the video, please like it, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you guys in the next one.